Welcome to this video in which we will be designing this stair. So let's begin. Select file, click on new, select part, click OK. Now change this unit from millimeter to centimeter and change the background to plain white. Now select this top plane and click on sketch. Make a circle at the origin and make another circle at the origin. Now select the smart dimension. Set the distance of bigger circle as 100 and smaller circle as 20. Now select this line and from origin to circumference make two lines. And then make a center line. Make sure the center line is at 0 or 180 degree. Now select these three lines and make relation as symmetric. Now select smart dimension, select these two lines and set the angle between these as 30 degree. Now select trim entities, trim this bigger circle, this inner circle and these two lines. Now the select is uh, converted into a shaded one. Now it's time to extrude this. For that go to features and select extruded boss. Extrude it up to 5 cm and then click OK. Select this front plane, click on sketch and then make a vertical center line here. Make sure it is at 90 degree and then make a line make a sketch like this and then combine it with the center line after that select this more dimension and uh, set this line distance as 3 similarly select this uh, line length as 3 cm and from here to here these two points set this to 8 cm And lastly select this uh, center line and set it up to 60 mm. Now make a line from here to here in order to complete the sketch. Now select this fillet, select these two lines set fillet parameter to 1 cm and then check the box now select this revolved boss base click on yes and then click the check box now select this linear pattern in direction select this line set this to 8 and set this dimension to 8 cm as well now click OK. Now select this top plane and simply make a circle here from this origin to this point. OK. Now drop down this menu and select helix. Set these parameters pitch. Set this to 9.25 and in degree uh, specifier 45 so far we have created this helix or you can say spiral and then click ok select this uh, sketch and edit this sketch uh, we do not have here a surface so you can import it from here go in surface exit the sketch simply uh, select this sketch and select this extrude option 
एक्सुडेड अप टू वन नाइन्टी सेंटीमीटर नाउ ड्रॉप डाउन दिस मैन्यू लीनियर पैटर्न एंड सेलेक्ट कर ड्रिवन पैटर्न इन डायरेक्शन वन सेलेक्ट दिस स्पायरल और हेलिक्स दिस वन दिस हेलिक्स एंड सेट दिस क्वान्टी टू 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 टेन चेक दिस इक्वल डायमेंशंस और इक्वल स्पेसिंग एंड चेक दिस ऑप्शन टेंजन टू कर्व सेलेक्ट द पिलर इन दिस विंडो एंड इन बॉडीज सेलेक्ट द बेस बॉडी दिस वन एंड देन चेक द बॉक्स ओके so far we have created this much geometry select the top of this object and click on sketch click on normal to and uh, make a circle here from center to this point and then simply exit the sketch in this uh, curve select this helix again now set these parameters set the page to 271 set this uh, resolution to 0.65 and set this angle to 86 degree and uh, set the direction counter clockwise and then check the box you can see this yellow curve this has been created using this helix spiral now go to reference geometry and uh, make a plane select this uh, new helix that we have just created we have to select the starting corner only normal to and make a rectangle here select the center rectangle and make a rectangle like this now we have to select three point arc select this point this point and specify this point make a shape like this then select the trim entities and trim click on yes trim these uh, inner geometry this line as well trim all this inner geometry the sketch is shaded now and then click okay exit the sketch we are almost done select this uh, swept boss and simply select this curve you can see this railing has been created and then click okay so the stair has been created we have to just uh, hide this plane and this uh, curved line and now apply some color to this you can apply any appearance you like i'm applying this one so if you find this tutorial helpful then please hit the subscribe button thank you